This is J.R. McGraw, Regional Sales Manager with McCormick Systems. In this video, I am going to show you how to copy and modify an assembly. Both are very easy to do. Let's start by making a copy of this duplex standard assembly in our database. To start, I'm going to right click on the assembly, click copy, then I'm going to choose copy insert and I'm going to select begin, end, and insert after. That will indicate this is the assembly I want to copy and it's going to insert it directly underneath the original assembly. Now we have two of the same assemblies to work with. To modify this new assembly, click on the byproducts tab and then you will now have access to the modification buttons, add mode, delete, and go to. Let's go ahead and add to this new assembly. When I put it into add mode, a new database window will allow me to transfer from my menu. I'm going to add a branch assembly into this duplex assembly. I'm going to find the assembly that I want to add. I'm going to hit the transfer bar and tell it how much I want. In this case, I want 10 feet. And now I just added to the new assembly. All I need to do now is modify the name of the assembly so I know this is one that I've customized and once I've done that it is now a part of my permanent database. And that's how you copy and modify assemblies. Thank you for watching. To see more of McCormick Systems you can schedule a personal demonstration by going to our website and clicking on the scheduled demo link or call us at the number on your screen.